Hey guys, welcome to another little tow review. Today I'm going to try this, um, it's new to me, I've never seen them in this, in this area at least, uh, Wicked Kitchen. Uh, this is the Macaroni and Cheese Hatch Chili. They had two other ones and they were all um, 250, 200, I mean uh, 450, 480 calories. So they were way too many calories for me. This one's a little over, but, um, but I decided to go ahead and try this one at least. Um, these were at Kroger for $4.29, so they're not cheap meals either. So we've got uh, pasta regat with roasted hatch chili peppers and caramelized onions and a spicy cheddar cheese sauce. This is vegetarian. No artificial colors, no flavor, no artificial, what, no flavor, no artificial flavors. And it says you can eat it right out of the box. This is what I mean by calories. It's 410 calories for the box. So um, it's a little high for me, but, but uh, I mean, it's all right. I'll probably go ahead and eat it. There's the ingredients. It doesn't look like they're too awfully weird. So how you make this is you just take the box exactly like it is. Don't open it. Put it in the microwave for four to five minutes. I'll probably do four and a half. Just go in the middle. Let it sit for two minutes and then be careful because it's hot and it says basically pull the pouch apart and eat it. So then it says measure the temperature, but we're not going to do that. So anyway, so you won't be able to see what it looks like. I've kind of peeked in here and there's like a little pouch in there. You probably can't see it. It's a white with blue writing, but anyway, um, we'll see it when this is done and I'll be back. Okay, here it is out of the microwave and I haven't opened, I just opened the flap of it. Um, so I'm gonna, I wanted to tape me opening it. I have two hands. Ah, I've got my tripod set. It says open here. So I'm just gonna grab it and pull. Uh -huh. Just like this. And it pulls the plastic part. There is steam coming out, so be careful. And it looks like that's it. You just literally eat it right out of the package, just like that. So there it is. I don't know if you can see it. Pick you up now. There it is. Um, it's kind of difficult to get in the corners, but uh, I'll, I'll figure it out. So, uh, so anyway, you don't get a lot of macaroni and cheese for that, I'll tell you that much. So I'm going to let this cool off. You can see the steam coming out. It's really, really hot. Get the peppers up towards the top, too, and, um, and I'll be back. Okay, it's all time to cool off. So here's the bite I'm going to take. It's got chilies and it's got macaroni in it. Um, the package, I did tear it up just a little bit on the top just to open it up a little bit more, but um, it's not bad to eat out of. Spicy, really spicy. Um, this pepper has got some spice to them. Um, it's not so hot where you can't enjoy it. The cheese actually has a good flavor too, but um, it is pretty spicy though. So if you don't like spicy food, don't buy this because it's spicy. It's borderline being too spicy to enjoy uh, the flavors of the cheese. It's not quite there, but it's pretty close. Um, it's for me. Now, if you like spicy food, you'd probably love this. You'd probably eat it up if you liked hot and spicy food. And what's good about it is though, it has flavor. It has a pepper flavor um, and the cheese flavor. And the pasta is a good texture too, by the way. Um, the pasta is cooked perfect. It's not too hard, it's not too soft, it's just right. Um, the the, it has a good pepper flavor that's hot, but it's not just hot to be hot. It actually has a flavor to it. So the green chili is actually, or the hatch chilies are actually, um, taste like peppers. Um, it's just hot peppers. So, um, so I think if you like hot food, you would enjoy this. If you don't like hot food at all, stay away from this. Me personally, I'm going to give it a four. It's a really good meal, good quality. Um, it's a little expensive and it's a little high in calories, but you get, you get a pretty decent amount of food. Uh, if I were to pour this on a plate, I mean, it wouldn't be too much, but it, it, it's okay. It's an okay amount of food, but the flavors are really good. Quality is good. Um, everything about it's really good. So yeah, I'm definitely going to give it a four. If you get these in your area, try them out. The other ones are probably really good too. I just didn't want to spend almost 500 calories on a meal for lunch, but um, for dinner, they might be okay. So I hope you enjoy this video and thanks for watching.